President Trump sounding off Sunday night, tweeting he wants to meet the whistleblower who represented a perfect conversation with a foreign leader in a totally inaccurate and fraudulent way. What's going on now is the single greatest scam in the history of American politics. Democrats disagree, saying the president took advantage of his power to solicit interference from Ukraine in the 2020 election. This is serious evidence of wrongdoing. The president has betrayed his oath of office. A rough transcript from the White House shows President Trump repeatedly urged Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky to look into Democratic presidential candidate Joe Biden and his son Hunter. The president did nothing in this phone call that's impeachable. Trump denies any wrongdoing, and critics of the coming impeachment inquiry say this is a bit of deja vu all over again, following special counsel Robert Mueller's Russia investigation. Democrats leading the probe disagree. After the last two years that we've been through, the president well understood uh, that it was illegal to seek foreign assistance uh, in a campaign. Uh, and immediately after Mueller testified, that is exactly what he was back at doing again. And the White House will soon find out if that is impeachable conduct. Our chef told 60 Minutes that his committee intends to subpoena documents from Rudy Giuliani, President Trump's personal lawyer. Giuliani was mentioned 31 times in the whistleblower complaint. He responded, blasting Schiff as an illegitimate chairman, but would not say whether he would comply. Dan Betty.